What's up, I Like Scary? So right now, you all, we are at HHN 32, and I got some of the family back there. You guys know since our annual Horror Nights trip. And uh, look, Bam's back for a second time. We all are back. And uh, yeah, this is it. Horror Nights. Got Stranger Things, The Exorcist, Believer, The Last of Us, Chucky. Watch your foot, man. Look at that, Yeah, guys, we are here. So, I like scary right now. We are at we Halloween. Here. <laughs> we, we here. Yeah. We're here. <laughs> we at Halloween Horror Nights, y'all. This is crazy. Yeah. We got them all back there.
Bro, we got one with Jack and what you call it. Alright, come on. Well, you all, we got a cameo from Dr. Oddfellow in the video. That is very crazy to get. So, so far it's going well. So right now, this is what we are doing. Everybody went to Stranger Things, so if we just do that last for real, for real, we'd be cool. Yeah. I think we should go to Exorcist. Alright. Exorcist is 25 minutes. Exorcist is 25 minutes. So right now, y'all, we're on our way to Actresses Believer. It was 25 minutes. What do you think this house is going to be? we seen it at uh, Hollywood. Uh, it's definitely going to be different from Hollywood, for sure. Yeah, in Hollywood, it smelled like doo-doo. So I want to see if it smells like doo-doo in this one. But yeah, we got everybody. And uh, can't wait. Can't wait to see what happened. I enjoyed the film. And I uh, can't wait to see Catherine and Angela in this house. And uh, yeah, I can't wait. I will see you guys once we get in the house. We just got out the Exodus Believer house. We did both on both coasts. Which one was better? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to say Hollywood. Yeah, Hollywood was better. What would you rate it? Uh, a seven. A seven? Yeah, seven. Uh, it's not better than the one in Hollywood. I'm sorry. But it was, they did it. I feel like Hollywood had the, the real prosthetics that looked like Angela and Catherine. These ones kind of were just like head prosthetics. I could see their real face, if you know what I mean. But Exorcist Believer is down. Rated seven from us. Next is Yeti Campground Kill. That's one of Monica's favorites. So, yeah, but uh, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. The Exorcist Believer is a seven for me, too. It was good, but the one in LA was better. So, more scary. So right now you all we're about to go to the Yeti. What you think about it, Miss Sheila? That was fun. And she said that was, was fun. Scary. And that little girl on the chair. Yeah. And then she's popped up and she scared the heck out of me. Yeah. That's that was crazy. And uh, for people that's just now seeing this, it smells like shit in that house. It definitely stinks in certain rooms. Yeah. But that's because of the exorcist. They wanted to smell like that. Did but, you see the ceiling that they did? Yeah, that's with the mad. with Angela. Yeah. But y'all, we about to go to the Yeti. Monica's one of her favorite houses. And uh catch you guys when we get there. Yep, you all, we on our way to the Yeti, but Stranger Things is 115 minutes right now. So. We will let you guys know once we get in that house, rate it, and uh, yeah, can't wait to see what this one is about. Very excited for this one. So you all, we just got out of the Yeti campground kills and but I'm not gonna lie, the Yeti's always good, guys. It's always good, but it is currently pouring down right now. But man, the Yeti looked so creepy. It kinda looked like King Kong. Monty, what you rate the Yeti? That's it Monty's. Was good. 10 Mon out of 10. Monty said 10 out of 10. It's raining, y'all. We got ponchos. This is the very first time we got ponchos from Horror Night. So, yeah. Um, this is how it's looking right now.
that right there is now the Exorcist Believers line. So you guys, right now I got a poncho on. We are about to go Stranger Things, guys. Right now we'll let you guys know what we think once we get out. So you all, right now, we're about to go on Stranger Things. And yeah, it is raining. Look, there's Miss Sheila back there. I was going Stranger Things, my most anticipated. So, we'll let you guys know once we get in. Look, you all, we got on ponchos. <laughs> Everybody has on ponchos, guys. Yep. Right now, this is it. Stranger Things season four line right here. So right now, guys, we are in line for Stranger Things. Oh, I see. The Yetis are right there, guys. But we are about to go on Stranger Things season four. This is my most anticipated. And we shall see. We shall see, guys. So you all, we just got out of Stranger Things season four. Man, what you think, Monty? Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten, bro. It was ten out of ten. I'm sorry. That was better. That was way better than Hollywood. Smoking on Hollywood. Yeah, that blew up. Uh, oh my God, bro. The scene yeah, with Dustin right. and Eddie, they pulled it off in Florida, bro. They killed it. it literally went through the whole house, had chills. The whole house, chills, chills. They even played running up that hill. They killed it. As of now, like I anticipated, Stranger Things season four, we're walking past it right now is my favorite house like I anticipated. So much detail. Damn, I'm going through there again. So, that's insane, what the f That was so crazy. But. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's what you call it, Bonnie. I know. Is Fedra from The Last of Us? Super cool. Yeah. So, you all, Darkest Deal, Dr. Oddfellows, The Last of Us, Universal Monsters. It is very cool, man. I've been to a lot of horror nights. This one is very, like, packed and different. Uh, so far, my favorite is Stranger Things season four. On the Hollywood side, I really enjoy the Exorcist Believer. But Stranger Things in Orlando, they killed it, bro. Uh, but yeah, there's males dying in the back. Crazy. Huh? 
Castle possess the ability to create new work. Wow, look at this. Beach in the fall. So you all, right now, we are going into The Last of Us. If you guys follow the channel, you know that this is, you know that this is my favorite video game of all time. Ellie and Joel, bro. So right now, we're on our way to The Last of Us, my favorite video game of all time. And yeah, I cannot wait to see what happens and holy shit. Oh my God. We will let you guys know what we think about the last of us once we get out of the house, guys. So see you all. So you all. The last of us, 90 minutes. So you all, we just got out the last of us and I'm gonna get that house. Uh, 8.8. I'm gonna give that house an 8.8 out of it. Got some of the actors coming out. But 8.8 Lush, right? I think season four boy really, really is de detailed. But I like seeing uh you know Ellie and Joel. They definitely surprised me with the bloater. And what you think, Monty? Yeah, it was good. I give it a 10 out of 10. Wait, you get out of 10 out of 10? Yeah, I really like that one. Monty said 10 out of 10. I'm gonna give it I'm gonna give it a nine. I'm gonna give it a nine. But I liked it. So we got a couple houses. There it is. There's the line. So right now guys, we are actually on our way to Chucky's ultimate kill count. Now I've heard that actually the one in LA over in Hollywood is better, but I didn't get to see that, so I don't know. I can't wait to see this, man. A Chucky hunted house. On our way there. So you all, right now we are going to Chucky's Ultimate Kill Town. I will let you guys know what we think once we get out of there. So you all, we just got out of 
Chucky, um, Ultimate Kill Count, and uh, I think it was like a 7, possibly a 6.5 out of 10. I think the DOS and everything took away from it, just the DOS in general. Uh, I saw what they were trying to do, but it was just like, um, yeah, I don't know. It was just different. I did like what they did, like, because at first I thought it was the, the end of the the house, but then after that we go through this little spot where they kind of take us through something else, and then we kick up. I think I like the second half. So, so far, Ultimate uh, Kill Count Chucky House is actually my least favorite, but we never know because we got some more houses that we want to get into, so... Yeah, yeah. Right now, guys, we are entering a tribute store. Hellfire Club, this thing. I know it does. And they got the actresses. And they got the Stranger Things shirt. you all right now this is day two for Halloween Horror Nights this is day two and it looks way better but they still are expecting rain but this is day two so yeah you all this is day two of Horror Nights Got some more houses to knock out. And uh, here we are, creeping up on them. So you guys, we are in the fog. This is it. Just walk through the fog. <laughs> Second day of horror nights. This is it right here.
So right now, guys, you might laugh, but we are actually on our way to go to Stranger Things for our second time this season. Mike be the first of many Stranger Things. We're on our way in. All right, y'all, we are in. Here we go. Right now we are about to go into Odd Fellows Twisted Origins. I've heard nothing but good things about this house. Nightmare fuel is going on in the background right over there. But we're about to go into um, Dr. Odd Fellows Twisted Origins. I cannot wait to see this house. I've heard so much cool things about it. The wait time right now is... <laughs> 30 minutes. Or a 30 minute wait for Odd Fellows. So, yes, guys, we will see you all once we get in there. And uh, we will see you all once we get out of there. And I will let you guys know what we think of this house. We will rate guys, it. Guys, we just got out of um, Dr. I Fellows Twisted Origins. And uh, I enjoyed it. It was definitely um, different than what I thought it was. And, yes, also, it was an 8 out of 10. I definitely enjoyed it. Very detailed. But... Next, we're planning to do Darkest Deal. So once we come out of this house, we will let you guys know what we think. But eight out of 10 for um, Dr. Offello's house. So you guys, right now I am at Richard's Burgers. I know it's loud in here, but we just got out the Darkest Deal. We're taking a, a break to get some food, but the Darkest Deal is my second favorite house. Very detailed. Um, I knew it was going to be good. The concept about the, you know, the guy selling his soul to the devil and stuff like that. But it is a very detailed house. And I really enjoy the segment with the music and just the jazz and everything. Definitely my second favorite. Uh, number one is still Stranger Things. So, guys, after this, we're going to go tackle another house. Once we get there, I'll catch you guys then. So you all, there it is, Universal Monsters Unmasked. It's 50 minutes. Um, we're about to go in. I'm definitely about to see what is up with this house because, yeah, I've heard a lot about this house. So I will let you guys know immediately once we get out about Universal Monsters Unmasked. 50 minute wait. Can't wait to see what they do with this one. And I will catch you guys once we get out. So you all, we just got out of Universal Monsters Unmasked. Man, this is, so now Universal, um, Universal Monsters Unmasked is now my second favorite. Darkest Deal just dropped for me. Um, so Stranger Things, season four, Universal Monsters Unmasked, number two, Darkest Deal, number three. So, man, bro, that was crazy. It was a lot of uh, jump scares in there that got me. The, the wolf was scary. Um, I think the wolf was probably the scariest. That shit was oh, getting. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, but here is the line for. There is the line. So, yep. Unmasked number two for me. So, you guys, unfortunately, this is the end of our horror nights video we are walking out right now but uh we did blood moon offerings the darkest deal i want to say i already rated that but we did universal 
Monsters Mask, that was super cool. We did Duel and Dragons, very cool. Dr. Oddfellows, it was fun. Chucky, actresses. Yep. But unfortunately, this, yeah. This is the end of the video. Comment down below which house you enjoyed more uh, this year for HHN32. We definitely will be back for the big 33. And um, yeah, this has been a fun video. I'm so tired. The event is over right now. And um, this is the Universal Globe right here. But yeah, you guys, I want you to watch some horror movies. Check that out. Stay scary out there. I love you all. Peace. Until next time, guys.